Now, every child of God is a member of the church. And Jesus is the head of the church. So, you have a tolerant savior as the head of your church family. Amen. Everything here points to the fact that you have a turnaround heritage. You have what? It's... Jacob was a turnaround agent in the house of Laban. I have learned by experience that God has blessed me for your sake. Genesis 30 and verse 27. Joseph, a turnaround agent in the house of Potiphar. And the Lord blessed the Egyptian's house for the sake of Joseph. Every child of God is redeemed a turn around agent to his world. Every child. That's why the Bible says you are a peculiar people. You are a royal priest. You are not a nation. You are chosen to show for the praises of him. Thank God for him if you were not here. Thank God for her if she were not here. That, so listen to me. There is no company you are working that will ever close down. Amen. When you are leaving your employment, they will be begging you to stay. Because of the turn around grace on your life. Now, listen. Those who do know their God, not knowing God by his name, but knowing God for who he is, you have a turn around father. You have a turn around savior. You carry within you a turn around spirit. So, you are a turn around agent. Now, from now, wherever you step into the turnaround unction, we keep manifesting. <laughs> Jesus came and said, We are the light of the world, we are the salt of the earth, we are assets to our world, no liabilities. Remove salt from man's nutrition, his uttermost is all is I mean it's deficient. Life is reduced to struggle. Salt has such powerful value to human existence. And that's who you are. You are the light of the world, you are the salt of the earth. You are redeemed a turn around personality on the earth. Now, from this moment on, the turnaround grace will start manifesting in your life in a new way. <laughs>